This is just a short introduction into CreatorDAO Amplify. So CreatorDAO built Amplify uh, based on our experience working on 40, 40 plus uh, content marketing campaigns for uh, Web3 projects uh, in the DeFi space primarily um, with some pretty cool forays into GameFi and NFT. Um, so what what we what we do is we're a DAO that um, essentially is made up of content creators, uh, marketers, um, sort of if, every every different type of role that you would think of uh, it to be in an agency. Essentially, we're an agency that functions as a DAO. Uh, so we work with clients. Um, with our clients are protocols, um, Web three projects. And what we've what we've done is we've done generally we start with a thirty day campaign, and anywhere between um, ten and forty, or e even more content creators will work on um, on the on the campaign. We have a dedicated project manager, and our campaigns are customized based on um, the the stage in the project life cycle. Um, and the goals that the, the project has to achieve. Now, in terms of goals, it's important to recognize that there's levels to um, there's, there's levels to goals. So our campaigns have primarily not been um, our payments and have not been based on KPI goals. So um, in fact, we take our payments up front, and projects have been, um, you know, overwhelmingly happy with uh, with the results that that we've got. But the payments are not based on results; they're based on the delivery of a content marketing package, which which includes um, sort of a, a minimum a minimum amount of content that we would produce. Um, and sometimes specified by which content creators would produce that content, um, just depending on the way we, we do our um, proposals. So what Amplify does is essentially amplifies this process and the outcomes that come from it. Uh, and the way it does that efficiently is by setting incentives to... Um, setting incentives to share uh, created our content, but ultimately uh, to share referral links, which can then be attributed to on-chain actions. So, if you think about if you think about the difference in dynamics between these two models, uh, what what you'll see is that. You like if you if you have a certain budget, let's say our, our normal uh, content marketing campaign budget is twenty five thousand um, dollars. There's a limit to there's a limit of the amount of content that you can create for twenty five thousand dollars. Each content creator has to be paid, obviously. Um, so there's a limit of how much content you can create. And our, cre our creators post their content to, on their own platforms uh, so their own audience sees that content. So that by definition, there's also a limit to the audience that we can reach with $25,000. Um, my estimate of our audience, uh, our combined reach is around 250,000 people. So what, what Amplify, like that, that's limited. So, that there's a limit to, I mean, you know, like obviously different different pieces of content can go viral and go, you know, go out and reach beyond um, beyond our network. And obviously, the network of the project that we're working with has, you know, um, a role to play in that equation as well. But essentially, there's there's some limits or some soft limits on on the reach and the impact of. A created our campaign in, in the form that we've been running them in the last year. What Amplify does is it gives you everything 
every everything Anna created our campaign plus it makes it scalable beyond those limits. And the and the way that works is by um, incentivizing the sharing of content and referral links where any anyone can participate. We can limit that by a whitelist and have very uh, exact targeting based on things like Twitter lists, uh, uh, Discord lists, uh, GitHub lists, or any on-chain, any list generated on-chain. Uh, and we, we essentially, we link a, a, a social media profile to, a, to an address um, so that if we need to use a Twitter list, then we can link that Twitter account to an address. And if we want to use an on-chain address, then we can link uh, the Twitter account to the address on-chain. And through doing that, we can ensure that, um, you know, for example, only people who have um, are on this particular Twitter list or only people have used a certain protocol or voted in a certain protocol or hold a certain NFT or a group of NFTs, um, any 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 list generated on chain, we we can use as our essentially something like a whitelist to um, basically do like a quality control on the and and, mar and sort of market targeting on the on the list of people who are allowed to participate and earn from these amplify campaigns. So an amplify campaign has a budget. This is um, so this particular campaign has a budget of twenty thousand USD worth of Fuji pre-token bonds. Essentially, what that means is that um, any anyone participating in this Amplify campaign by by copying a tracking link and sharing it um, can earn their share of this 20 twenty uh, k USD Fuji pre-token bonds. And that will, the calculation to um, distribute that payout is based on on-chain goal that the campaign has. So in this case, the, the on-chain goal is defined in the payout methodology. And essentially, it's $2.5 million borrowed on the Fuji, Fuji platform. Um, over a 30-day period, and then we go into details about the methodology of how that works. Um, so just to simplify, um, let's say there's three referrers. Uh, one referrer is able to um, share their links with, let's say, 100 people, and those 100 people all borrow um, $10,000 each. So that, that would be a million dollars worth of borrow. I'm, I'm simplifying a little bit here, but this, will, this should, should give you the idea. Now, uh, this one referrer, let's say that's me, has a uh, million dollars worth of borrow attributed to their uh, tracking link. So I can go and share with a friend, and then my friend can click on this link, and they'll go to... Uh, Fuji, and then we have a, a small script that will send back the address and uh, the Twitter handle of my Twitter, which matches um, which matches up the referee's address with the referrer's Twitter handle, proving that this particular address came to the platform because of a link that was. Um, Unique to this Twitter, Twitter handle, the referrer's Twitter handle. So that, that's, um, that's a, you know, the TLDR on how uh, we do tracking. And then whatever happens on chain, uh, we create a, we create a custom tracking system. Um, so essentially, we can track any on chain KPI. We can also do off chain KPIs too. So um, yeah, you have the campaign overview here. Um, with details about the campaign, how it works. And then we have uh, 
uh, more details about the token that's being paid out. And if I reload this, we also have um, another feature, which I think is pretty cool. Uh, essentially, um, something like a media kit with a collection of content that's been created by Creator DAO, or it can be uh, it can be by um, the project. It can be by any contributor to the project or any um, any member of Amplified DAO, essentially. Um, any useful content that can um, that can help uh, people understand um, what Fuji is, how it works, how the Amplify campaign works, etc. So it's a, a useful feature because essentially referrers, uh, publishers, or newsletter writers, um, you know, social media um, personalities, anyone can come in and and find out. Okay, what. Um, what is this campaign all about? Um, how can I earn? You know, when will I be paid? Um, what's the pro What's the process for being paid? Um, find out more information about the token, and find out um, you know interesting, useful uh, pieces of information that they can then go on to use in their own content that they share along with a referral link. I'll copy the referral link and they'll go out and go into their own platform and create, you know, for example, a, um, a Discord or Telegram announcement or a tweet or a, add this um, add this content to their newsletter or an article on their blog or share it with uh, friends and direct messages, etc. And uh, this is... Um, this is how Creator DAO uh, will scale our our existing content marketing um, campaigns um, well beyond um, you know the, the capacity that, that we've had so far. Um, Amplify will have a its own token, and actually uh, for this Fuji campaign, we'll be uh, providing an extra twenty k. An estimated twenty, an estimated twenty k value worth of Amplify tokens, uh, which will also be earnable. Alongside, we have a big, uh, we have a big airdrop, uh, a substantial uh, portion of the total supply of Amplify Amplify tokens will be um, will be airdropped conditionally. Uh, to um, publications, newsletters, um, social media influencers, etc. There's going to be a whole bunch more information about that coming uh, really soon. But alongside working on, alongside becoming a referrer for the Fuji Expedition and a couple of other campaigns that will be added here shortly, um, you'll be able to earn the Fuji pre-token bonds plus. Um, Plus Amplify uh, Governance Token. Plus, you'll be able to earn uh, on top of that um, by using the platform um, conditionally, based on the results that you get on these on these campaigns. Um, your share of uh, the Amplify airdrop. The Amplify airdrops are a little bit um, different to um, any other airdrop that's been done before, because it uses the Amplify system, and it's all based on um, KPI metrics as well. So the, the, the purpose of Amplify is to be able to uh, create campaigns that are predefined in their ROI. Um, so we use financial on-chain metrics primarily as our, as our metric um, to calculate ROI um, and therefore it's the they're about is the least gameable of any type of incentivized campaign that you can run, um, and we think that uh, running uh, an Amplify campaign alongside an airdrop campaign of any kind, or alongside uh, a liquidity mining uh, program, or um, even a, even an NFT mint, or essentially any on-chain action that that you that you want to achieve that's measurable. Running an Amplify campaign alongside that will give exponentially better results mathematically. But um, 
yeah, as you can probably tell, I'm super excited about Amplify. I don't want to keep rambling on for too long. But, uh, I'm glad that I've been able to give like a, just a little mini um, demo uh, of it. We've also in the process of writing um, documentation and we are also looking for contributors. Um, and there's still a few um, there's still a few roles left on the founding team as well. Um, so be on the lookout, follow Created Our Twitter. Um, join Created Our Discord if you want to get involved with helping to build Amplify, or if you want to, um, you know, have book a call to discuss um, how you could uh, leverage Amplify, Created Our Amplify um, campaigns, um, you know, to help uh, grow your protocol, um, no matter which what stage what stage it's at. Uh, we'd be happy to um, jump on a call with you and discuss it. Awesome. All right. Talk soon. Peace.